YouTube. Hey, had to tap in real quick, man. As the market comes to a close, wanted to do a really quick recap on the day it was. More importantly, focusing on the things we were in or possibly in, okay? Listen, guys, I'm going to kick it off with Lucid. And then I'm going to touch on BBIG, all right? So listen, down below, I don't care how it went, good, bad, or indifferent. I want you guys to let me know in the comments if you did anything today with those plays, if you were able to kind of catch the run-ups, or if it dropped too fast for you to do anything, and then let me know how you went about it, okay? But listen, guys, the market is continuing its downward trend. It's continuing to sell off the nature of the stock market, okay? That's what comes with a downturn or when interest rates tick up for whatever reason, when inflation is on the horizon for whatever reason, these are the things to be expected. That's why as an investor, your trading plan, the diversification, all of those types of things somewhat come into play, but I'll be honest, man, it don't matter. Everything across the board has been hit, will be hit, and so it's just the lay of the land. Some people call this the no trade time of year where you just don't make any moves, okay? You just let the chips fall where they may. I beg to differ. I feel like you can always be doing something. So with that being said, guys, check it out. Major salute to this individual right here that sent some love on today. Many of you sent me something. So major salute to those that did, that knew what they were doing and were able to still take advantage of Lucid, even though it tried to run up 7%, okay? I told you to watch out for a fake out breakout, okay? And again, I'm apologizing on behalf of the manipulation, guys. It seems like every play I give, I'm either a day early or the day I give it, it want to do the opposite of what we're trying to accomplish, okay? That being neither here nor there, that's just what comes with the territory. Hopefully, you guys see it for what it is. And for those that don't, still wish you guys the best of luck as well. But check it out, man. Lucid, okay? Now, when you guys look at the chart, even though it ran up, it had so many ebbs and flows. It had so many highs and dips, highs and dips, even though it was trucking higher each and every time. Let me know down below if anybody took advantage of that, even though it was way out of our price range by the time market opened. Everything we had put in place yesterday was for $38 and below. It came out the gate, 39 went right to 42 and boom. Now listen, this is one note that I wanna make. Guys, I record these videos most times after hours. There's no way of knowing what the market will do or be like the following day. However, the principles are solid and the principles are still the same. So check this out. Even at 42, 42.77, I'm just thinking about Lucid, okay? 42.77, Somebody could have bought there and still sold at 40. Still applying the principles, it just would happen from a different price. However, without even convoluting things, I am happy for those of you that just might have said, you know what, I'm going to fall back because I'm looking for these numbers we discussed and the market has spiked up significantly from the time you might have got the information. So that's a viable game plan too. Sometimes guys, you don't gotta chase it. If you don't like the setup, fall back. No need to take an unnecessary loss when we might have spoke on one thing and it does another, okay? Now, some people could have did a call while it was running up and then waited and anticipated this eventual fall down that we knew the fake out breakout was gonna do. Now it wanna be sitting down here in the 39s, okay? Listen, guys, this all comes with the territory. I'm hoping those that got the right mindset is taking all these little things in. Now I wanna transition very quickly to BBIG. I noticed, man, that this stock, again, two days in a row now, was trying to be pinned down between $5 and $5.95 for the longest, okay? Then it broke out several times, but the breakout, high was only like 535 ish okay so that's another piece of intel that we got to take into account six is our price target 535 is all it could really reach both days during market hours it's ironic that they try to let it fly or run a little bit during after hours though 
okay? That being neither here nor there, guys. You have to be nimble. You have to take what you see and take what they are giving you, okay? Now that it finally broke through 495, because that was being strong support, it finally fell through the 430 level, found some support and has bounced back to like that 430, 450-ish level trying to be 460. So that's a new range, okay? Listen, guys, some of these plays, like I often say, you got to get in and get out. The game is not going to give you nothing easy, especially in a downturn. So a lot of this stuff take in as just learning and watching in case you don't fully know what you're doing so that you can avoid it. For those that want to dive in and learn and get these experiences under your belt, I'm all for it. I'm all with it, okay, guys? That's just how I roll, okay? Chances make champion and scared money don't make no money. However, guys, when you got a bunch of people, it can, again, it can get real scary for some. But with that being said, guys, let's get ready to do it all again tomorrow. I'm going to give some more guidance on not only plays for tomorrow, but also things to look out for as we expect a more downturn in the market on tomorrow. OK, so listen, guys, great job today. Keep up the good work. Apply these things, man. Let all these lessons shape you and make you, okay? It ain't going to be easy. I can't stress that enough. They're not going to give you an easy win. But if you start learning how to win during difficult times, what you think it's going to be like when the bull market returns and everything is running to the moon, okay? It's called easy money, man. Prepare for it because it's coming whether they want it to or not. Listen, guys, we make videos like this every day. So if you like this one, make sure you check out the next one. Remember, most people see the end result. Very few consider the journey. Do me a favor. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Make sure you guys grab some free stock using my link below. And I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.